Hey everybody, a couple weeks ago I picked up a tube preamp, wanted to check it out, see if I could uh, change my sound around a little bit, and I'm using it right behind me, it's a Art MPA3, and we're recording with it right now, straight into the camera, and I wanted to see if changing out to these general electric vintage tubes would change the sound well for the better i've heard the chinese tubes in it are actually pretty good and you won't make that much of a difference and well you know hey it's tubes everybody has an opinion about tubes and a couple of comparisons that i found out on youtube these ge's really sounded nice they had a very balanced even sound they didn't emphasize or de-emphasize any part of the audio spectrum they were just pretty even all the way across the board and for a preamp I think that's really what I want. I want to get a good basic general sound going in. I don't want to cut or boost the high end, the low end, the middle for the most part. I mean you can always do that with EQ after the fact so just record it right. So let's just get right into it. I'm going to record a few things on the guitar, just a couple sounds, a couple chords to let you get the sound of the Chinese tubes and then we're going to go and change it out and put in these GE tubes and see what the deal is. Okay, let's take this unit apart. It's pretty simple. There's just a whole bunch of screws you gotta spin out, take the lid off. And to remove the covers, all you have to do is push down and twist uh, maybe an eighth of a turn, maybe less, and they come right off. I was really careful to sit here and align these pins. Uh, it's best to just kind of get a visual on it, and I went around to the back side of the unit to make sure that I really had these lined up instead of mashing the pins because that would have been a pain to try and straighten out if you didn't snap the pins off. Twist the covers back on. So it really only took a few minutes to change everything out. That was pretty simple. Let's go see what it sounds like.
So yeah, in this quick test, these GE tubes definitely sounded better. Um, I don't know if I want to use that warm word because it's just such a ridiculously overused term out there. Uh, I think the word that I'd like to use is fuller and the tonal response was just more balanced across the spectrum, pleasant, easy on the ears. Uh, those are the terms that I kind of describe putting these GE tubes in. Um, certainly the Chinese tubes worked, but you know, they were just, they worked. And that's all I'm really gonna kind of say about that. Overall, I think this was a great quick improvement considering it took me, yeah, about 15 minutes to find these on eBay, wait a week, and then I had to install them, which really only took a couple minutes. So yes, changing the tubes out for the right tubes is definitely a worthy consideration. There are a couple other mods on this unit that you could also do, specifically changing out a couple of the op amps. I know there are some other more crazy detailed mods with changing a whole bunch of resistors and capacitors. Not sure that that's really worth it. But changing out a couple of the op amps because it's a relatively simple job, well, Disassembly of this thing is a little bit of a beast, but once you do the swap out, getting cleaner, lower noise preamps into this, or op amps rather, uh, would definitely be a little bit of an improvement, but I don't really find the unit to be terribly noisy in the first place. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below.